Welcome back to Makeup Mental, everybody. I'm getting ready to lay the top portion for the cab on top right here. But as you can see, the front side has got a slight arch, and then the rear side does not. This arch will come to you naturally if you decide to make something like that. It will naturally be higher in the middle than on either side. And excuse me, all I did was cut straight across straight across on the back side. But I put a very small layer of hot glue focus in the center right there to try and build it up a little bit, not much, a little bit right there, let it dry. That way I can take my piece, my final piece, and glue it down and squish it down accordingly. If it, why did not want to focus? Come on. Might be a little bit too bright now, but that will give me my arch on the rear side. My fingers being in a way, you'll have to use your imagination, but that will give me my arch. You may or may not have to do something like that. Depends on how skilled you are um, making these things, or if you're a person that takes four hours to decide if, you, if it's a life or death situation before you make the phone call to 911. You know, this might better work for you or not. But you could, I've spent less time on this than I promise you, you would even programming this into your 3D printer, although not finished yet. This is just a rough outline. And plus it's gonna be fiberglass once it's finished. So there is a look so far. We'll get the cab of the truck done. I'll get it somewhat rounded over, get this sanded up. Get that sanded up and other areas that need addressing and I'll start working on the back half of the tr truck and then eventually it will be cut down so the bottom side meets flesh with the bottom side of the chassis this looks goofy right now I know but that this is not permanent this is just something to set a standard height this is a four inch block it will be cut down this will arch for the suspension and stuff will probably be put more up there but this is just to give me a reference you always want references draw yourself some basic lines if you have to for ideas if something doesn't glue up right take it off glue up another piece who cares you know you're gonna end up or at least i am i'm gonna end up fiberglassing in a new place these holes don't line up with my pre-existing body holes anyway this hood that I used is just simply because I wanted a foundation to start with. This kind of gives me an idea. I do like these little design pieces right here, here, and here. You know, I do like that little bit of design. I'll try and keep it. Maybe it won't be there. I don't know. But there's all kinds of what ifs in the future. So there you go. There's a look so far. Have a good day.